Welcome back, and we are so happy to be joined on the BMW desk by one of our favorites, Maria Sakri. Great to see you, as always, here in Tennis Paradise, getting a win in your first match. Needed to come back there, but, but finished really strong. How were you able to kind of flip the switch? Well, I'll be honest. I think that first set and a half was probably the worst tennis I've played in a while. Um, but, you know, sometimes you have to accept it and just uh, try and get yourself back into the match, and that's what I did. I just tried you know, to put more balls on the court. I've done it so many times, so I was like, okay, you can do it one more time. But, you know, sometimes it's ugly. Uh, well, most of the times it's ugly. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, you know, I think that end of second set and the, the whole third set was very, very good. Maria, you know, over the last sort of 12, 18 months, we've, you've been, we've been fortunate enough where you've come and spent so much time with us. So we get to see your progression through your game, your, your physique, your, your mental side of things. And mentally, you keep getting stronger and stronger. You know, a match like this, Diana put a lot of pressure on you early in the match. You didn't play your best, but you finished better than you started. You kept fighting all the way through. What are the things that is allowing your mental to be stronger now than it was maybe a year ago? I just feel like I accept myself more on the court, and I just uh, know that you know not every day can be perfect. Uh, if anything, you know you'll you'll just have two or three days uh, in a year where you'll feel everything you know super good and like everything's going in, and you you know you don't have to force yourself. So I think that's a uh, that's a thing that I've really you know worked on, and staying in the present. That, that's a, that's a big thing for mm. me. Well, in addition to being able to pull out wins like this, it seems like you're in a great space because of the place we're in. Yes. You know, I, I, know you, I know you love it here. So Indian Wells, talk to us. Well, what is it that makes Maria Sakri light up about Indian Wells? Uh, I mean, how can you not like this place? It's, um, <laughs> I think, you know, the place itself, it's just so beautiful. Uh, the organization, uh, I mean, it's packed every single yeah. day. Uh, people love their tennis here. Um, I mean, look at the mountains. The, everything is just so beautiful, and <laughs> I just have good memories. You know, I always love to come back, and it's great when we get a week before the tournament because we can really enjoy mm -hmm. everything about it. And I just um, there's you know there's a lot of things I like about this tournament. There's a reason, Maria. They call it tennis paradise. Oh yes, uh, yes. Uh, I couldn't agree more <laughs> with you. Yeah. Uh, so you get a win today with your new coach. David yep. Witt, uh, you know, somebody who has been with top five players in the past, the Grand Slam champions as well. What, what was the search process like for you to, to land on David? How many people did you think about and, and why did you pick him? Um, you know, I'll be honest, he was the first person that uh, crossed my mind. Um, I know David from before and I just feel like, well, now I get to meet him more. He's, he's an amazing guy. I just, you know, really enjoy my time with him. Obviously, this is a trial period, but you know, hopefully, you know, things can go well, and um, you know, we can continue. And I just feel like um, he's very experienced. He's very, very good on what he's doing. He's so funny. Uh, I just, you know, like to spend time with him, which is very important to me. Um, and he's he's a very good person. That's uh, that's you know, we've been together what five, six days, but you know, I can I can tell if someone you know is nice is nice or not. And David is, uh, he's, he, yeah, he's great. He's amazing. He's obviously had great success as a, as a coach on the WTA as well. How has the, um, how has the growth been on the communication side of things? Because it's, it's a very interesting relationship because you got to find, uh, you, well, because when you speak to someone, when you don't, when you say something, when you don't say something, how has, how has that been for you guys? Good. I mean, I think, you know, we'll get to, uh, we're meeting each other. We're getting to know each mm. other uh, every day more and more. And I just feel like, uh, you know, we just, um, I don't know, I feel like there is chemistry, be, you know, between us and the whole team, and I just feel like we're getting along all really well. Um, he's he's so relaxed, he's so laid he back, he's, he's so easy yeah. to work with, and I just feel like um, that's what I need right now, someone that, you know, because I push myself a lot, I'm very hard on myself, so it's good to have someone that is, you know, uh, how can I say, it? like, he keeps me grounded and he keeps me, you know, uh, a lot more relaxed than uh, I am by myself. D tell us about uh, the, the coffee you're bringing around here. What, oh. what, what do you have on the trip? <laughs> well, um, I do have plenty of coffee machines in the house. Uh, coffee, you know, everyone loves their coffee in, for in my team. Um, the co coffee's like a very popular thing in my team, uh, <laughs> even, though, even though David doesn't drink coffee. Oh, wow, yeah. wow. really? No and caffeine. that didn't just cut him off right away? You're like, oh, we'll no, still give you a shot? No, I'll give him, you know, I'll give him a shot, yes. Um, 
but you know, I just travel with my machine, so I, I get good coffee everywhere. That's that's uh, that's the secret. Okay. That's amazing because yeah. you you get to know when to pull that caffeine button. Right. You know, do you have the coffee right before the match? Can you spread it mm. out through the day? Today I only had I only I had three shots of espresso in the morning and that was it. That was it. Yeah, I haven't had okay. any more. Maybe you know. After you guys, I'll go a back home. A little afternoon top maybe, up, maybe. maybe. Just a little. Maybe. Just but one shot. Not, Just one shot. not too late because then I want to sleep early. And true, if true, I true. drink coffee too late, maybe I won't sleep. And it's fair. So, yeah, you know, some days I do uh, drink not not so much coffee. Yeah. Yeah. It, you you got to be careful because you don't want to overdo, overdo it on the caffeine. Yeah. I did see you were like an undercover cashier oh, here. Yeah. Tell me, <laughs> what was that about? That was funny. I really enjoyed it. Uh, I was actually right there, and I was selling popcorn and drinks. Okay. <laughs> um, people at first didn't recognize me, and then um, I had a lady that she came up to me, and she was like, I know it's you. And I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> and, and she said, I know it's you, Maria. And I, I, and I said, I get that all the time. And <laughs> so then she took a picture with me, and then you know there was another lady that she took another picture with me, and then... Some people didn't even recognize me. And then I went out here. It wasn't too crowded, but I went with like six bags of popcorn and I was just without the sunglasses. So I was just giving popcorn for free. And some, there were, there were two guys down there. So there, there was a hidden camera. Okay. And two guys over there were like, um, watch it because you're being recorded. And I'm like, well, I get, I, I get that all the time. Like I'm, I'm used to it. <laughs> uh, and the guy was like, who are you? <laughs> like, why are you saying that you're used to the cameras? And then it, it was fun. It was one of the nicest ac activities I've done. It is. It's, it's Oscars weekend. Yeah. She, you, it looks like you'd have been a great actress. Uh, yeah, I was like walking around and screaming, who wants popcorn, popcorn, <laughs> anyone? I was just there. You know, I was selling it really well. So wh where can we see this stuff? Is it? I, I don't it? know if it's out yet, but okay. soon. Okay. I, I'm, I'm sure it's going to come out soon. <laughs> no, that's all I <laughs> you, you should ask the people behind the scenes. Okay. Yeah. Can't, can't wait for that. Yeah, all I right, think well, it's funny. Congratulations Thank on the win you. today. Always special to catch up with you and hope to see you again soon. Yeah, you too.